charge and negative charge yes positive charge and negative charge everyone give a big applause for it yes sit down there are two types of charges they are positive charge and negative charge the charge the charge was from the electric charge was formed by benjamin franklin who is a american scientist he was the first one to find charge electric charge he was he found charge as two types one is positive one negative protons will be positive and electrons will be negative okay now how an object will be get charged now if an object is getting charged we will call that charged object so how an object will be get charged How an object will get charged? Yes, anyone can say what are methods of charging? We will call that methods of charging. Yes, again, Darwin they will be able. Sir, the, um, I think uh, three types are which are uh, charging yes. by conduction. Yes. Charging correct. by induction. Yes, correct. Next and, one. Uh, sir, uh, charging by friction, sir. Yes, everyone, give a big applause for him. Take your seat. There are three methods. 
methods of charging. Charging methods of charging means how an object will be get charged. Okay, charging by conduction, charging by induction, and charging by friction. The first one, charging by conduction. What is charging by conduction? Can anyone have any idea? Yes, you are correct. Charging by conduction means when an object, when this object, this is an object, it is a charged object. And the meaning of charged object is that object will be having charge in it. That is called charged object. And this is another object which has no charge in it. When I am touching this object with this object, this both objects will get be getting charged. That is called charge in conduction. But in this step, it is very easy to understand because both charge, both objects will get equally charged. Okay. Now this is charging by conduction. And next one, charging by induction. What is charging by induction? Yes, charging by induction means now uh, this is a charged object. Now I am touching this charged object with an object with no charge. That time that is called charging by conduction. But when an object, for example, this is an object that is a charged object which has charge in it. For example, it may be positive charge or negative charge, but electrons would be inside this. When I am taking this near to this object, this object also will be getting charged. It just will be like a Wi-Fi, wireless energy. For example, you can uh, keep in memory as your uh, Wi-Fi down in your schools, which will be uh, help you to play tap classes. That time, this will be like a Wi-Fi. For example, when I am keeping this near this charge object, this also will be get charged. So, this is, this also have a disadvantage in it. What is the disadvantage means? When this is a charged object, when I am coming here, this, this object will get charged. But I am taking this again uh, far away from it, it again will be having no charge. This is called charging by induction. You can keep it in your mind as wireless, wireless uh, energy or Wi-Fi. Okay, next one is charging by friction. When I am rubbing both objects, there will be a charge. First of all, what is friction? Friction is when we rub both objects, fire, uh, when we rub both object, uh, object, something will happen. The process is called friction. For example, when we fire a matchstick, for example, we are giving matchbox here and we are rubbing it with the matchstick and it is getting fire. How is it possible? That is called friction. Now, for example, this is a charge, uh, this object, and when I am rubbing this both object like this, this both object uh, will get equal charge, that is called charging by friction. Okay? Now, everyone understood about methods of charging? Yes, yes sir. Okay? Now, everyone start doing your class activity, classroom questions with your pair, and uh, after completing your classroom question, I will ask you your summary, then you have to summarize your summary. Yes. Now, everyone shift with your pair and do your Classroom questions. Yes. Everyone complete our classroom questions? Yes. yes, sir. Okay. Now, we will move to our summary. Our summary is methods of charging.
If you are uh, keeping any uh, thing not completed, incomplete, yes, now you can complete. Yes, you have completed. Yes, sir. Okay, tomorrow we will meet students and your practice 10 questions or 1, 2, and 3. Your practice 10 page number is 129 and all questions are very simple and easy. You have to do it on your own and you should not copy it from anyone. Okay? Yes, sir. Yes, we can meet tomorrow.